Andy, many congratulations. You've made it your first World Championship final. How do you feel? Oh, I'm on top of the world. It means the world to me. This is the world. And I'm just so ecstatic and emotional. And so many things are going through my head at the moment. I'm just, I'm just so glad to be there. And I've got, I'm waiting now for the next next two to play their game to see who I play in the final. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, it was a match that had absolutely everything. You raced into a 3 1 lead. He came back 5 3. What was going through your head? I never thought I'd lost it. I thought I'd just got digging deep and just get back in. I never thought I'd lost the game at all. Just digging deep and just do what you can do. A couple of good finishes got me psyched up again and got me aggression going in. And that's, and that's my game. I need that aggression to keep me focused and they come through at the end of it. That, the ninth set in the fifth leg, I think, was a beautiful 1 2 9 to set off the, I think it was 32, that's wasn't right. it? Which you took for the set. Do you think that, that was what gave you the edge? Yeah, I think it's little things like that where you set up a double and put pressure on them to finish it, big out shot or whatever, and to just take it out is just a. Uh, it's just, just a great feeling and that, that, that was on my game today. It was later on in the game when I had to take big shots to leave something or take a big shot out to win the game. You said uh, in previous interviews that you, you've been so relaxed up there. Was that the case tonight or was there a few nerves about I, I was a bit relaxed. I, just, I, wasn't, ner I wasn't nervous. I was, I was focused and I just I lost the game in between. I went three one up. I thought, what's happening? I'm having a game where it shouldn't be happening. It should be two each really in a way when you think about how professional you are. But it wasn't mm -hmm. happening. And I just tried to dig in, and it wasn't out me. And he went to fourth year. I thought, oh, I don't lose it, don't lose it. Just dig in again, dig in and grit a good game on it, and that's what happened. And, uh, and finally, a quick word on uh, on Simon. What a tremendous achievement from his point of view as well, because he was, he was written off at the start of the tournament, 33 to one long shot, I think he was. And to get to a semi final like that and play an epic, fantastic. Awesome bloke, professional bloke, and I have loads of respect for Simon Willock. He's a gentleman and show me loads of respect at the end. And uh, what can I say about the man? He's, he's had a great tournament and uh, he'll come back hopefully when his legs better, he might do better next time. Andy, congratulations. Best of luck. Cheers, tomorrow. thanks a lot. Cheers, Andy. Cheers, Cheers thanks. Pleasure, mate. Cheers.